welcome back to the Happy Wife Life, or welcome if this is your first time joining me. I hope you'll stick around and subscribe. And in today's video, I'm going to be sharing part two of my Super Bowl party prep. First up will be my Super Bowl sensational meatballs. They're budget friendly and they are delicious. The last thing I'm going to be sharing is my Marry Me strawberries. Stick around. Okay, guys, let's get started on the Super Bowl sensational meatballs. They're going to be cooked in the slow cooker and you just need minimal ingredients. You're going to need grape jelly, original manwich sauce, and you're going to need any type of barbecue sauce that you like. And of course, your favorite meatballs. You're going to start by taking a package of meatballs and go ahead and dump them into your slow cooker. Once you've got those in the slow cooker, go ahead and mix up your sauce. I'm going to pretty much be eyeballing everything. I'm going to use an entire can of manwich sauce and make sure you get the original. I don't like that bold and zesty one because it gives it too much of a sour flavor. Then I'm going to eyeball my Kraft Sweet Brown Sugar barbecue sauce. I'm going to add that in. And I pretty much use just about the entire container. Next, you're going to want to use your favorite grape jelly. I'm a Welch's snob, so I'm using Welch's. I'm going to eyeball about two cups, which is just about this entire container. Once you get your grape jelly mixed in, you're going to want to give everything a quick whisk. How simple is that? These are super budget friendly ingredients and they are going to give your meatballs a great flavor. Now, if you have time to hand roll your meatballs, by all means do so. I do have a video where I make homemade meatballs and I'll link that in the description box if you're interested in that recipe. But for now, I'm taking the easy mom's way out, frozen meatballs. Once you get this all mixed up, cover your meatballs. Make sure every one of your meatballs are nice and coated. You're going to cover this. You're going to crock it on low for about two and a half hours. How simple is that? Stick around. Okay, guys, I'm back. Let's get started on, this is probably one of my favorite little snacks, and I call them Marry Me Strawberries, because if you eat these, you're going to want to get married. That's how good they are. You're going to need your favorite cream cheese cake frosting, crushed pecans, which I've already crushed up right here, and you're going to need strawberries. How simple is that? You're going to take your cream cheese cake frosting, stick it in the microwave for about 30 seconds until it's kind of loose and almost like a honey consistency. And all you have to do, take a strawberry, dip it in, and roll it around in these crushed pecans. How simple is that? And these are going to be delicious. And like I said, if you have a significant other or boyfriend or husband, serve these. They're going to work out well for you. I'm going to go ahead and get the rest of these put together. And when I come back, I'll show you how they look. Stick around. time to sort out all the fights yeah. to sort out all the lies oh baby yeah oh, no. there was a part of me that knew that and still i'm caught by surprise oh. i thought you'd always be mine 